Hi everyone, it's Jillian and welcome to my channel and another crochet tutorial. For today's tutorial, we're working on the popcorn coaster. There's two versions of this coaster and I will leave a link to the pattern in the description so you can check it out for yourself. Let's get started. To begin, you're going to start with a magic ring. You're going to make a chain one. Inside your magic ring, you're going to make eight single crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. You're gonna pull your magic ring close and you're gonna join to the first single crochet with a slip stitch. And that is the end of round one. For round two, you're gonna start with a chain one, and that chain one doesn't count as a stitch. Into the same stitch as the slip stitch, you're gonna make two half double crochets. You're gonna make two half double crochets into the next stitch. And you're going to make two half double crochets into every stitch until you get to the end of your round. And you're not going to be walking into this stitch because that is a slip stitch. When you made a slip stitch at the end of the round, you're going to make a slip stitch to the first half double crochet stitch. And that is the end of round two and you should have 16 half double crochets. For round three, you're going to chain one and you're going to make a half double crochet into the same stitch as the, stitch, as the slip stitch. Into the next stitch, you're going to make two half double crochets. And this is going to be a stitch repeat all the way to the end of the round. And you're going to repeat one half double crochet into the next stitch. And two half double crochets into the next. And repeat. Continue with the sequence and I will meet you at the end of the round. Around four, you're gonna chain one and you're gonna make a half double crochet into the same stitch as the slip stitch. One half double crochet into the next stitch and two half double crochets into the next. And this is gonna be your stitch repeat all the way to the end of the round. You're going to repeat by making one half double crochet into the next two stitches, two half double crochets into the next, and repeat. And you're going to continue with this sequence of stitches and I will meet you at the end of your round. At the end of the round, you're going to join with a slip stitch to the first half double crochet stitch. And that is the end of round four and you should have 32 double crochets. For round five, you're going to chain one. You're going to make a half double crochet into the same stitch as the slip stitch. 
you're gonna make a half double crochet into the next two stitches and this is gonna be a repeat all the way to the end of the round you're gonna make two half double crochets into the next stitch and you're gonna repeat by making one half double crochet into the next three stitches two half double crochets into the next stitch and repeat by making a half double crochet into the next three stitches and you're going to continue with this sequence of stitches and I'll meet you at the end of the round at the end you make a slip stitch to the first half double crochet And that is the end of round five, and you should have 40 double crochet, 40 half double crochets. Round six is gonna be our last increase row before we start making the popcorn edging. For round six, you're gonna chain one, and you're gonna make a half double crochet into the first stitch. One half double crochet into the next three stitches. Two half double crochet into the next stitch and this is going to be a stitch repeat all the way to the end of the round you're going to repeat by making one half double crochet into the next four stitches two half double crochet into the next stitch repeat one half double crochet into the next four stitches Two half double crochets into the next. Continue with this sequence of stitches and I'll meet you at the end of the round. You're going to join with a slip stitch to the first stitch. And that is the end of round six and you should have 48 half double crochets. For round seven, you're going to chain three. And you're going to make your popcorn stitch into the third chain from the hook which is your first chain and for this pattern a popcorn stitch is four double crochets into the same stitch so you're going to wrap your hook and you're going to go into the stitch and you're going to make four double crochets one two three and four. You're going to remove your hook from the loop. You're going to pull up on the loop a bit and you're going to count back four stitches. One, two, three, four. And you're going to insert your hook under that first double crochet that you made. Both loops. You're going to put that loop back on the hook. You're going to tighten it a bit and you're going to pull it through. And that creates your popcorn stitch. You're now going to chain two. You're going to skip two stitches, one, two, and a slip stitch into the next. And this is going to be your stitch repeat all the way around. Chain three. Make four, half, four double crochets into the third chain from the hook. Three four. Removing your hook from the loop. One, two, three, four. Chain two. Skip two. One, two. And a slip stitch into the next. And repeat chain three four double crochets into the third chain from the hook
chain two, skip two, and a slip stitch into the next. And you're going to repeat that sequence all the way around until you get to the end and I'll meet you there. At the end of the round, you should have two stitches left. One, two, you're going to chain two and make a slip stitch into the slip stitch from the previous round. And you're going to fasten off by chaining one. And that is the end of the tutorial. As always, thank you for visiting my channel. Please like and subscribe for more video tutorials and I'll see you in the next video.